Today I am in Mission Trails Regional Park in San Diego and I'm gonna do Kwai Pai Peak Trail. It goes up about a mile, 1.2 miles and back. So about a mile, about two and a half miles round trip. And I've heard it's real steep. Um, I've never done it before, so I'm excited to do it. It's a little overcast today, which is probably good because I forgot my hat and sunglasses. So hopefully it'll stay that way. You can probably see there's a way that, uh, trail that goes up that way and another that goes up this way over here. Um, I've heard that I've, uh, some guy just walked by and told me this way is uh, really steep, um, just shoots straight up the mountain, but then it actually drops back down. So um, he was saying he prefers this one because it's just more gradual and kind of continues to go up the whole way. So I think I'm going to take his advice and head up that way. Located about eight miles northeast of downtown San Diego, Mission Trails Regional Park encompasses more than 8,000 acres of mountainous open space, making it one of the largest city parks in the country. Despite being surrounded by suburban neighborhoods, the park's expansive coastal sage chaparral and riparian ecosystems are home to numerous animals, including bobcats, coyotes, deer, and many native lizard and bird species. The San Diego River flows through Mission Gorge, offering a rare year-round source of flowing water in this arid landscape. The area of the park north of the gorge is typically referred to as the Fortuna area, after Fortuna Mountain. The portion south of the gorge is often referred to as Coles, a reference to Coles Mountain. Kwai Pai Peak stands proud on the southeast side of Mission Gorge which is fitting since Kwai Pai means chief in the language of the Kumeyaay people who called the area home for thousands of years prior to the European invasion. There are two trailheads to choose from. The one that you come to first when driving along the road that heads towards the gorge makes for a one and a quarter mile hike to the peak. This is called the Kwai Pai Peak East Trail. There's parking along the road. The west trailhead is another 0.3 miles further along the road, where the one-way portion of the road that comes through the gorge, which is called Father Junipero Serra Trail, comes to an end, near the old Mission Dam parking lot. If you enter via this trailhead, you shave about a quarter mile off the hike to the peak. While steep and less well maintained, this trail has the advantage of being more isolated, with no houses spoiling the natural scenery. With either fork, you'll gain about 240 feet in elevation, up to where the trails merge and then head up to the peak. Just for reference, I think this is the Kwai Pai Peak East Trail, which is the one that follows along these housing complexes. I don't know, so far I'm not really digging the, um, digging being so close to all these houses. Um, it's about to start climbing pretty steeply though, look. Dropping down into a little gulch here, and then I'll head back up. I wonder if there's a little bridge. It's a pretty deep gulch. There you go. Oh, look, there is a bridge. I was right. There was a bridge. Two gold stars for me. Here we go. Little bridge here. You can see there's a gulch here. It comes down, and then goes down the hill here. So I'm imagining during the rainy season, you get some water, you can kind of see it. It's, there's a ditch down in there and water flows through here. Um, it is the end of August right now. So everything's super bone dry around here. We had a little bit of rain about a week ago, but um, yeah, I mean, it's pretty dry. It's still really, really pretty though. You can see, um, you know, even, even the dry plants, there's a lot of, cool colors, a lot of gray and brown and green kind of mixed together. 
I think this is the split where the two trails connect. So the, um, the one that went up steep from the very beginning and then the one I just came from, which is down here, that followed along the side of that housing complex. That's the one that went up steep and then he said drops down and comes back up again. Um, I think I would probably do that next time. Like many trails in Southern California, along the side of the trail is a uh, sage, which right now you can probably see it's off there. It's that kind of grayish brown stuff that's all over the place. It's senescing right now for the summer when it's hot, but during the wetter months, it turns bright green and you can, well, you can't smell it, but I can smell it. Still, it smells like, um, well, actually that doesn't smell that much. Yeah, that one smells, it still smells like sage. There's also, um, I think this is called lemonade berry bush, which is still green. You can probably see that. It's um, on the tips there. And it forms these little berries that taste like lemons. I don't know if you call them berries exactly, but they look like little berries. And um, my understanding is that the Native American Kumayai people that used to live in this area, Kumayai, would um, suck on those while they were traveling across the, you know, the game trails and trails they used to migrate around the region. One quick rant, dog poop bags on the trail. See, why bring a bag if you're not gonna take it out? I don't understand. Okay, so I just came up to a rise and um, I think we're near the peak. It looks like the peak to me, so I'm almost there. Okay, I'm here in this open space. You can probably see the trail goes up to the peak right there. I think another trail might go down over there. And I'm guessing there used to be some trails over there, but they don't want you going that way anymore. Um, pretty good view this way of the cliffs inside the gorge. There's a peak over there. I'm not sure what that, where is that peak? I <laughs> can't see it, it's over there somewhere. I'm not sure what that peak's called, but it looks like a good hike too. Yeah, this part is pretty steep. It's just like right up this hill. Some really steep switchbacks in here. I'm not gonna count those, but that's a lot of steps. Oh boy, yeah, this one's steep. You definitely earned the, the last uh, 300 feet or so. Where are the lemonade berries when you need them? Definitely the peak here. Oh yeah, there's even a marker. Wow, it's a good view. So that way is west towards the ocean. You can kind of see downtown San Diego is kind of in the fog over there. Um, this is Mission Gorge in here. And here, that other peak over there whose name I don't know, but we'll find out. Here's a little marker. Okay, I made it to the top and now I am headed back down. 
I'm not going to record much on the way down just because you've seen it all. But I will actually stop at the uh, that place where there's the split where you can choose which of the early trails to come up. And uh, in that area, I'll actually take the, the left as I'm coming down and, and see what that trail looks like. I have a feeling that would be my preferred trail just because, you know, staying away from the... Uh, the housing complex and noise and uh, dog poop. So um, we'll see. I'll, I'll turn the camera back on when I get to that section. You can see the housing developments over there. And this is the way I'm headed. You know, the sign here basically says you can go either way. So I guess I'm going towards Old Mission Dam. I think, I don't know if you can well, you can see it, but there's kind of uh, down near the river there in that river valley in the gorge. There's a lot of trees, and um, I think that's where the mission, old Mission Dam was. And that was the dam that the, uh, the Spanish missionaries built back when they first um, started to colonize San Diego, the, the region. fork I took when I was coming down I took a left fork and I ended up here at Kwai Pai West Trail so anyway I think if I were to do it again I probably would just park in this parking lot over here which is kind of at the entrance to Mission Trails it's actually where the the road the, the one-way road that comes through the trail comes out here and then the, the bike lane on the bike and walk lane on that side ends and then there's a parking lot right down here so i probably would just come and park in this parking lot and then go up that way um, this is what it looks like where i am it's the old mission dam historical site parking lot so next time i will come here and just head up that way so that was Kwai Pai peak it's a steep hike brings you up to great views and uh, gives you a good workout for sure I wouldn't do it on a hot day because it's pretty exposed and it's, you know, it's overcast and there's a nice breeze right now and I'm still pretty hot. Hope you enjoyed that and uh, if you have any questions, put them in the comments below and I'll try to answer. See you next time. A link in the description below will bring you to our full guide to hiking Kwai Pai Peak on OutdoorSoCal.com.